Shout out to the EA Creator Network for allowing me to capture this early Madden 24 footage. And just remember that all Madden 24 footage is a work in progress. What's going on guys? Today I'm going to be playing Civil and Madden 24 regular teams. I'm going to match up whatever team he uses. So if he goes Chiefs, I'll probably end up going Jets or one of these other really good teams. I don't really like using these OP teams because it's going to be, you know, not really realistic for, to what Mud is going to be early on in Madden 24. As you know, um, by now, or maybe you don't know, like the Chiefs have uh, Gunslinger. The Chiefs have Hara Matcha with Mahomes. They have Kelsey, which is insane. The Jets, who I'm probably about to use because I really do like them, have A-Rod with that Gunslinger and that pass lead elite. So, guys, I'm going to match his Chiefs with probably the Jets. These are definitely the two best teams in Madden 24 at this given rate. And hopefully this is a, ends up being a good game. On the offensive side of things, I'm going to be in the New York Jets playbook. Probably the best playbook in this game. Now on defense, we're going to go to good old reliable 4-6 defensive playbook. Guys, this year, this game would probably not be happening because he was on Xbox last year and I was on PS5. And I mean, now look where we at. We have cross play. We, we can play anyone we want. This is honestly amazing. And it just takes away another aspect of stressing and, you know, trying to find games. You can play anyone you want now, any given moment. This Jets roster is pretty stacked. If you haven't checked out my video on the top five rosters in Madden 24, go check it out now. Um, I break down every single roster and why you should or shouldn't be using them. The best players on that team, all that good stuff. Right here, we're going to be using Ashton Davis. We're going to put Chuck Clark in there with Jordan Whitehead. And we're just going to get into the 3-3-5 wide. And we're just going to hoop. Hopefully, we could slow down this air game that the Chiefs have. They're really stacked. I mean, I'll show you the abilities real quick if I can get, get all my guys. And great defense to start off. He's just going to end up throwing that ball away, even though it looked like he was throwing it to Kelsey. I'm going to do this real quick, guys, before I... um. He calls hike. One sec. Let me get my adjustments out. And boom. There's the def There's the abilities for Mahomes and Kelsey. Uh, pause it if you need to because those abilities were literally insane. Right here, he messes up the free form. That's something that's going to take a little bit of getting used to, guys. Sometimes, I, even myself, I messed up the free form. But right there, I mean, he was open. Not a really good sign. He's in the tight slots. This tight slot is so good yet again this year. Any type of tie is honestly effective. Any type of tie is really effective in this Madden. Right here, we're going to try to send some pressure, right? We're going to try to send some pressure. We have 25s. Hopefully, those corner routes could get guarded. Right here, he was going deep. He might have had it. He might have not had it. I don't know. I had Amos back there with a 25. But nonetheless, it's going to be really hard this year to go deep on those deep passes. Hopefully, I can lock up one more time. I'm going to put 20s maybe with some 10s underneath and probably play coverage right here. Right here. Boom, boom, boom. Amos on the 10. Hopefully, uh, the whole middle of the field is mine. Hopefully, you know, these corner routes don't run by me. Please be nice to me. He has a deep post, and he's going to cook me with MVS. That's because I have DJ Reed there, and that's just an unfair speed advantage. I got to be better right there and put in the, my better player. Uh, let me see who I had. I knew I was missing someone. Instead of DJ Reed, I should have put Eccles there. He's 93 speed. Nonetheless, good good dot right there. I should have uh, should have played more smarter. You know, I should have made sure my fastest guy was on his fastest guy. Should have blitzed. I should have done a bunch of things right there. And like I was saying earlier, guys, these teams are honestly as far away from Mutt as you can imagine, at least day one, right? All right, guys, here we go. We are in the Jets playbook. One of the best, if not the best playbooks in Madden 24. Time to cook up with A-Rod. He's in this nickel normal. I think he might've gotten some lab and done already. We got McCole Hardman out there. We got Conklin and we're gonna take a delay game. Quick audible right here. We're gonna run a little bit of this gun bunch strong offset. It's really good, honestly. It is really good right here. Um, nice little quick throw to McColl Hardman. And he breaks off a tackle but ends up eating a hit stick. Um, definitely got to be weary of these hit sticks. I haven't, honestly, knock on wood, I haven't fumbled once I, in, my, I, like, in my recollection. I have not fumbled once, which is a good sign, guys. It really is a good sign. Um, you know, I don't know. It might be a good sign. It might not be. Right here, he has good defense. I'm probably just going to end up throwing the ball away. I maybe missed a read or two, but a couple of my routes got bumped. And here we go. Wide curl. It was a really good play last year. Let me see if I could get some space. I got Hall open in the flats if, uh, if I need to throw it. And we're going to go there. We're going to go to Hall in the flats. We're going to take a juke, and we're going to take our yards. What is that? A gain of 15 or so. Moves the chains. Great read. All right. We're going to switch it up a little bit. We're going to audible. This is what this Jets tour. It's really a Jets tour this year, right, guys? It is a Jets tour. That's what we're calling it. I'm going to audible right here. Quick read. And that's the thing now, guys, the high throw drop. Uh, I did not need to high throw it, but it's just like a force of habit, right, from years prior. 
from highballing those open seams. I, I just had to do it, right? I just had to do it. It was open. It was there. I'm like, all right, you know what? Let me just highball this real quick. And no, do not do not highball in this year's game. Even if they are wide open. I don't like that feature, but it is what it is, guys. All right, here's going to send the blitz. And I might have had that tight end open, but the thing is I can't highball. I can't highball over his zone. Otherwise, he's going to drop the football. So a mystery right there. Or maybe not a mystery. I don't even know what to call that, guys. Let me know what we're calling those high ball drops in this year's Madden. Um, if they're fluke. If they, I mean, it's, it's not really fluke. It's the game. But, uh, you know, get it under pressure right there. So a tough, a tough, a tough couple breaks for us right now. Um, after, that, after that play we just had, kind of like slowed our momentum down in my opinion. It's all good. I 100% think he's blitzing again. Let's see. And he ends up not blitzing. We're going to take our read. Verticals. When in doubt, verticals it out. It will always be there for you through thick and thin. Always trust verticals, guys, because it's got your back. Right here, we're going to run bunch tight end. The Jets tour is alive. It's alive. It's alive. And it's alive. There's a dot to McCole Hardman up the seams. Number six. I want to say 97 speed. This Jets team is cooking right now. Um, a couple misreads. Not the best drive, but we still end up getting seven definitely much needed guys i cannot wait for the jets tour to be honestly like on 99 overall right now i would say it's like an 85 overall maybe like somewhere in that area but once we get hard match once we get these cracked players with these abilities it's gonna be up there trust me guys all right guys right here running low cover to mabel he runs the ball great run play i took the wrong gap to pursue but it's all good amos got her back gain of five definitely not sweating that right here guys gonna just run a little bit of man I have my speed demons on the field now, so we're good to go. And he is running a little bit of audible, so we're gonna um, make a couple adjustments ourselves. Make sure everything is guarded. Everything looks bagged, and I'll take that. I'll take that any day of the week, even though you know it should have been bagged. I don't. I don't mind that honestly. Right here, he's going with flood once again. Look at that. Three plays, three three uh, times with the running back being involved. One was a run play, two were passing plays. So. I told you guys, the running back has so much stress on him this year. Right there, unfortunately, just couldn't get my adjustments down, but it's all good. We're, we adjusted right here. He's going to block his tight end. Amazing defense right here. He cannot throw anything. Ends up throwing the ball away. I was ready for flood. Made perfect adjustments. Made, I just had to make sure his tight end was on a route, and I also had to make sure my user was crisp right there. I'm going to run the same defense again, honestly, because if it ain't broke, what did they say? Don't fix. If it ain't broke, don't fix. I assume he's going to put Kelsey on a route right here because... I mean, he's it's, it's Travis Kelsey, bro. You got to eventually put him on a route. Cannot waste him in blocking every play. And he's going to block him again, and we get pressure. We need that to be, you know, a sack or something because ain't no way he got that ball out, coach. All right, guys. I'm liking what I'm seeing. Going to run a little bit of coverage right here. Make sure. Honestly, at this point in time, I'm literally going to just guard Kelsey. My, I'm going to man him up because, yeah, it was a good guess. He ended up putting him on a route this play. He's going to try to throw this on the run. Just make sure we're bagging him up, and we end up bagging him with Jordan Whitehead. I'm telling you, this Jets defense is nasty. If you love playing defense, if you're struggling on the defensive side of the ball, if you could get away on offense by playing good offense, I highly recommend you run with this Jets team. I'm going to run a little bit of nickel normal right here. I got to make sure my subs are all set up. Ah, they're not. I'm going to call a timeout. I know I, I, just, I just really hate giving up fourth downs. I know you guys do as well. So I'm going to make sure my subs are set up and, and cor are correct. Right here, we're going to put Gidry, 96 speed demon. I'll show this roster a little bit later. Boom, we're going to put up our guy, DJ Reed. He has good zone. Ashton Davis. And then we're going to put Chuck Clark here. And we're going to just call a little bit of nickel normal. Right here. He, oh, he audibles out. So um, a little audible by him. Definitely got me thinking now, like, what is he going to call? I don't like this defense. Hopefully we just get a lucky shed and he ends up not calling the best play and we end up getting the sack with big Quinn and Williams, big Q. So there it goes, man. This Jets team is alive and well. If, you, if you're a Jets fan, if you just like tired of running with the Packers and the Bucks each and every year, you could definitely rock with this Jets team. I'm not sure what that was because I did not freeform that, but it's all good. Um, the Blitz is definitely making me a little like... You know, I don't have any safety reads because my safety read last year was, we all know what it was. It was a high ball when, when in doubt, high ball it out. This year, I'm still trying to find that safety read. And it's looking like it's going to be the running back this year, right? 
There it goes again. The running back is open. I might have had that corner out, but just just a second too late. I know with A-Rod, you could fit in a lot more passes than the normal QB. Um, but just didn't see that till the last second. Right here, I really want to complete this to Alan Lazard. I just don't know how uh, wide curl it was going to work this year, if this, this safety is going to guard it. And we're going to try to pass in dot the needle, and we just can't right there. We're going to go for it, though. Definitely thought I could sneak that pass in. Um, it's all good, though. I'm trying to think of what play I could call right here. And I think, I'm, I, think I found the play. We're going to go with this uh, Durham play. It's pretty much verticals. And I'm going to block the tight running back. I don't know. This is a this is a weird setup. Um, and my slant just stopped running. I don't know what that was. Good defense, I guess. I should have put my running back on a route. Um, but dang, my slant just stopped running for some reason. I don't know. I had nothing open, honestly, on that play. But I, I still could have I could I still could have made something happen. And when I say that, I still could have thrown it right at his user and got lucky. But it's all good. We move on. Right here, same thing. Just making the same adjustments. We got to score seven on that drive, man. 100% got to do. Uh, but it's all good. We move right here. He's going to have the middle of the field open. And I'm noticing, man. I'm going to let you have those deep chunk plays now. It's uh, it's super hard to go deep in this game, man. You're going to get shedded, especially when someone like me. I'm sending five every play. It's super hard to go deep. Right here, a little bit of shade underneath. And, man, just make sure. I really don't want Tony to get open on this corner out. Thankfully, he does not call it. Um, nothing is open. He's going to playmaker this guy. Which way does he playmaker him? Thankfully, he didn't throw it. Thank you for not throwing it because some people would have just said, all right, I'm throwing it. I guess this year you really can't highball that. So he couldn't, there was nothing open for him there right there. I'm loving the defense we're playing. It's just a matter of a matter of time before he gets Kelsey and the gang involved though. So just got to, just got to stay on our toes, play good defense right here. Just make tackles, that's fine. As long as he doesn't get the first fourth and inches somehow. Don't ask me how it was fourth and inches right there. I really do not know, um, but it's all good. Lock up, we'll lock in one time, one play at a time. Try to get the stop real quick and then, you know, try to get seven. Right here, playing a little bit of risky defense. Trying to get the stop. Let's see what we got. And there goes the running back again. Can't be mad. He got bumped up for a while. I just need a little bit of pressure right there. I'm wondering I'm curious if he sent out his tight end or not I'll have to rewatch that because he got a lot of time if he did send out five I don't I don't think he did but you never know nowadays you, you just you never know if they sent out five or not a little coverage right here really just don't want McKinnon to get the ball because man he's been cooking me right here sauce is gonna say that's mine and we drop a pick we drop a pick oh man I saw that from a mile away you guys saw that I clicked on, I called it out, and we dropped the pick. Come on, Sauce. We got to pick that off. That's easy reads, easy picks. Right here, it's going to probably go back to the running back. Okay, he has that deep post open, but he just, like I said, you can't tow those in this year's game. He was going to have it open once it passed the safety, but it's just so hard to get those deep passes out. And it doesn't help that he's using Mahomes. I mean, I probably have an advantage in that aspect of me using um, A-Rod, but even with A-Rod, his deep release has never been... You know the best right here i didn't get to blitz my user so he might have a good amount of time sauce get crazy you gotta pick that off instead that's gonna be a touchdown somehow some way i don't know how ah sauce is killing me on that drive i thought for sure i think what sauce is six foot four i thought he was gonna be able to jump out the roof that was a 25 cloud flat and i know you could throw that but like just just the way it looked it looked like i was gonna i should have swatted it that's what i should have done guys I should have tried swatting it, but you know me. I felt like I was a deserved to pick on that drive, so I tried to go for the pick. Somehow, some way, end up being seven, but we move. Um, I don't know how we got bagged up in that red zone that one last drive, but you know, if we score right here, we're good. We do get ball at half. All right, guys, let's get it. His nickel normal is definitely kind of throwing me off. Like I, he, I don't know. I just really can't make a read on this uh, nickel normal that he's running. So. Let's go back to our old reliable, try to dink and dunk, throw to our running back. He's sending everyone. I just I can't catch a pass for some reason. I don't know what is going on. Definitely kind of frustrated right now, but it's all good. Just keep moving. Keep trying to move the ball down the field. We'll get something happen soon. And right here, that's such a risky throw for me to throw it out of bounds. That could have definitely gone picked by Sneed. But uh, I felt like it was open, right? I definitely felt like, you know, there was, there was something there just... Unfortunately, we didn't get our didn't get our uh, hands on the ball. 
right here just trying to get a trying to get a first at this point at, in this point trying to throw into the running back and he picks us off wow very risky adjustment i do not know what that was i think he manned up his running back my running back to the uh cornerback safety to the running back and i probably missed a read right there i'm not gonna lie he's i don't know what that was i like i had everyone open probably and i just made the wrong read for a second i mean this cross man i thought it was open but uh, I don't know what happened. I end up throwing a pick right there. Two passes. I mean, I don't know. I just can't get my hands on the ball for some reason right now. Uh, we gotta, we gotta score right here. This is a big drive to score. We do get ball a half. We play, we're playing good defense, right? I'm not tripping on the defensive side, but he is low key playing good defense as well. All right, man. So clearly the bunch isn't working. We're just, we're, our routes are stopping. We can't catch the ball. A bunch of weird stuff is happening. So let's just go back to some you know consistency something we've ran a couple years now in the making a little bit of bunch tight end i don't want really want to run tight right now maybe when i get to the red zone it's just without those routes route cams and all that it's kind of hard to run tight we're gonna block our tight end right here and honestly we're just gonna cook he's like he's liking to send this blitz and that's great defense right there that's really good defense right there i can respect that he put his uh line d lineman in a flat I did Max Protect, so he ends up playing coverage, I think, right there. Maybe he sent the corner on the side. But it's definitely it's definitely hard living right now, getting these yards. Um, I just got to make my reads. And it doesn't help that my guy is blinking right now. Right here, we're going to try to go up top. We're going to have a touchdown to McCole Hartman. I'm not going to lie. I don't know if anyone else that's a touchdown with, but McCole Hartman, 97 speed, definitely helps me out quite a bit. We'll take it. Two touchdowns on the day. Both of them coming on streaks, via streaks. That's probably what I missed on the play. I threw the pick to the running back. I, I think I had McCall up the seams. It's just like, you know, it just it just comes down to the fact that my dude is faster than his. So that's what regs really comes down to quite a bit of times. It's speed advantages and, you know, ratings advantages. Well, we're not complaining. We'll take it. We got to get a stop right here and then somehow find a way to score before half. Um, and we're going to be back in this game. And it doesn't help that he has bazooka, but we're good. Trust. Just got to, you know... Right here, great defense. No, it isn't. Uh, Kadarius Tony absolutely cooks us. Just make tackles, man. We can't make a tackle. That's what's really hurting us right now is that we're not able to make a tackle. And Flood is, you see it, guys. Flood is looking really good this year. Um, I just I mean, can't man him up for some reason. And I'm getting quick hiked as well. So definitely got to mix up the zone coverages and all that type of stuff. Right here, won't let me audible for some reason. It's because he audibled himself. Um... Okay, hopefully he doesn't burn us deep. All right, I'm liking this. Hopefully it's good defense. He missed all his reads. We get the sack. That's big. We take away his uh, bazooka ability. Right here, we're going to run a little bit of 25s. Please do not get burnt deep. It's flood every single time. All right, he's going to get our purple out on the field. We couldn't get our purple out on the field for some reason. That's fine. That's fine. He had a couple other open reads. I'll take it. I don't know why I couldn't get my purple out on the field on that play, but it's all good. We're going to run the same defense again. Right here. Let's see what he does. It's, it's flood again. He can't throw it this time. He throws that. That's Amos. You can't try Amos. He's one of the best defenders in Madden in the past few years. Shout out Amos. Can't, I didn't even know he signed with the Jets. Um, he's definitely ring chasing at this point. Shout out my guy. Hopefully he gets the ring. Right here, let's let's try to attack these flats, man. He's giving us these flats. It's like you see what I'm what I'm reading right now. It's that corner route. Is it open or is it not? Like I can't highball it. I could free form it over his head, but like that could definitely get picked. Honestly, I don't know. I'll, we'll take our five yards and we'll keep it moving. Right here, throw to the running back. We got to get that ball out, a Rob. We got Slinger one with Gunslinger, and whew, okay, we're good. We're good. He's he's sending the dogs quite a bit um gotta just make reads at this point right here we got time and we're gonna make a dot can we get our feet inbounds and we do under pressure shout out to a rod for i would have i would have been raging though i can't even lie if we don't get our feet inbounds right there i would have been i would have been pretty mad honestly because it's just so hard like it's just so hard this year to get open passes completed right here great defense we're just gonna throw it away there was nothing open uh, maybe match maybe a little bit of those safety third adjustments so that's when I what I mean when tight is good trust me tight is really good but without cams it's a little tough to run this year right
because uh you know it's just it's just not how it used to be where you know corner routes are always open every play they are open but it's just you know these these DBs now are really good. Like they, they react to these corner routes. Right here we got Garrett Wilson. Would have been nice to get out of bounds. Get our yards on that slant route and keep it moving. The corners react quite a bit better this year compared to years prior. We're going to go back to this bunch tight end. He's going to send the dogs. And I don't know if I could throw that, guys. The thing is, if it's open, but it's a red zone. And sometimes they stop running. I should have gave it a try. It's all good. We live for another down. We get we get three yards on that, honestly. I can't complain because he did send the dogs right there. Um, I might try it again. This time I'm going to smart route it. Smart route. Boom, boom, boom. And then we're going to slant this guy. All I need is time right here. This is really all I need is some time, and we might be able to dot up. And I had it. I just didn't get the time. I smart routed it. It was the right read. I just didn't get enough time. We got one play, and then we're just going to kick our three. Hopefully, Zerline can make it from here. Um, definitely do not want to get sacked right here. That would suck. Get sacked out of field goal range. And I'm looking for Hardman. You guys see it. I see it. And he blitzes a crib. I could definitely get a first right here. And we are end up, we're going to end up getting the first with a chance to get seven right here. And, man, this is that Jets tour. He got really aggressive right there trying to sack me out of field goal range. And shout out PA Seams for having that nice little uh, nice little quick out. I'm trying to think of a play to run right here, guys. I think I might have one. I'm really just attacking the seams on this play. It's a it's a touchdown or it's a bust. Um, yeah, I'm attacking the seams right here. We got a nice read right there to McCole Hardman. And I'm not going to lie, if we don't have McCole Hardman right there, we get tackled in bounds and it's a half. I might have had one of those open reads. It's just you can't high ball up the seams this year, guys. It's virtually impossible. The ball is going to get dropped. It's going to get knocked out. A whole lot, a whole lot is going to happen. You know how the, you know how it goes. Right here, going to just make a nice little route combo. Just try to make the read. And, and we got the read. Can we catch it? Yes, we do. Great end of the half. Um, obviously, this isn't like no, nothing's on the line besides just bragging rights and nice high-quality competition. For YouTube, for you guys, but man, I know that hurt. That would hurt me if I gave that up. I guess civil. He like it. Like he's wild. You know, he he blitzed the outside corner. <laughs> what was it? Third and nineteen. Just I guess he was trying to get me out of field goal range. That's that that that, that does make sense. I would have done the same thing, but ends up backfiring on him. But he's running this nickel normal pretty well. Like not a lot of people uh, have ran this so far versus me, and it's definitely making me think. I think he's running like a lot of cover three cloud. That's what it is. And obviously versus nickel normal, you really want to attack the flats and kind of like make reads to the flats, the tight end and the running back. And he's doing a pretty good job of taking it away. The thing is though, I've had the middle of the field open quite a few times and it really just comes back down to the matter of fact, do I see it and do I see it in time? I've seen it a few times, but the thing is like that pressure gets in there before it's too late. And it also does help that I have Aaron Rodgers on those, you know, nice quick little uh, flick of the wrist throws. So right now, I mean, I'm in this game because of A-Rod and because of McCole Hardman. Uh, my defense has been like, it's been all right. It's been 50-50. I've gotten a pick with Amos. Really good uh, pick by him. But I've been giving up a couple corner routes one too many times. All right, guys, we're going to mix it up a little bit. We have this uh, tight doubles right here. Honestly, a really good formation in this year's game. Um, and we're just going to try to cook. We're just going to try to cook. That's At the end of the day, that's what we're going to do on offense. We're going to try to cook. Got some nice routes going over all the way on the field. We got this drag route. And it's going to be... How is that under pressure? He sent three people. Where like, did, did Chris Jones go nuclear? Like, I did not do anything right there. All I did was throw to an open drag. And phew, I don't even know. Almost thank God it wasn't a pick. But the thing is, it's going to be a pick next time probably. And then Mutt, like, oh man, we gotta we gotta watch out for these under pressures, guys. Fearless might be meta once again. Right here, there's I have the tight end open. Oh wow, we have Garrett Wilson. We get quite a bit of time. Juke to the outside. Great stick work right there. Great stick work by Civil. He was expecting the juke. He knows how good the jukes are in this game. Civil, good stick work, man. I mean, you got robbed out of a pick last drive or last play, but you know, way to make a tackle. Honestly, not a two, not the best two plays for me. Um, to start to drive i'm just having trouble reading that that cover three cloud like it, which one is he gonna guard is the corner route gonna guard the streak or excuse me is the uh the cloud flag gonna guard the, sh the corner 
or is he gonna guard the other route? It's right here. You just can't highball. You just can't highball. That was a that was an amazing dot, a absolute beautiful dot, and that I feel like that's just like there's no one there. Let me throw it. But I don't know, man. I don't know. I'm gonna run the ball right here because he is in dollar. That's one of the things you're gonna have to do this year versus dollar is test the rundy. Do they have rundy? And I'm not gonna call that rundy. I'm gonna call that poor vision by me. Really bad stick work. Definitely should have been a couple yard gain. But it's all good. We keep it pushing um, right here. I'm just gonna try to cook up once again. Oh, man, I just these high balls. They're open reads, man. Let me throw them. Right here, slant route, when in doubt, slant it out. There goes Garrett Wilson, rookie of the year to the Baja. Somehow good seven on that drive. Whew, this is this is gonna be a fun year, man. We got opened high balls. I know, like I said, I understand it. The high balls were way too good last year. 100% patch them. Don't make me drop an open high ball like that. Cause if I free form that, maybe yeah, I could complete it, sure. But I don't know, man. It's gonna be super tough to free form without abilities and mutt. And I feel like that's just an, like, it just makes it a little bit easier for me to highball that. But I understand, you know, I don't know. We'll, we'll see. We'll see as the year progresses. Let me know what your thoughts are on that, that play. Because you saw it. I cooked up a nice dot. That's a nice new play in the Jets playbook. It's called Flood. I have breakdowns on that on my TikTok and all that stuff. And it was the right read. You know, I attacked the soft spot of the field, the tender spot of the field. But the thing was, it, uh... He ends up dropping it, but it's all good. We move on. Maybe that's that's too tight. I think that's two high balls to the tight end. That might be it. I don't know. Maybe Conklin's too low in overall. Maybe his ratings don't match up. But enough talking about that play. Let's move on. I'm gonna run nickel normal eventually on this drive, guys. He's been he's been a little too comfortable versus um you know this defense I'm currently in. Right here. Once again, just make tackles. And what I tell you, bro, it's so hard to make open field tackles. I personally, I don't know if I jurtle. I feel like that's a little too scary, but you know, Civil ends up journaling right there. Right here, we're gonna just put a three wreck on the field, even though I don't know what it's gonna do. Three wrecks have a mind of, its, of their own. Right here, let's see what we got. We actually play phenomenal defense. Three wreck was kind of there as a spy, and if there was anything across the middle, and I, like Civil loves going deep. I, I want him to. I want to see him roll out more. Um, I sound like I'm containing. Of course, I say that I'm gonna start containing right now. But yeah, he hasn't really roll, rolled out too much in this game. Right here, he's gonna try to go deep and he finally gets it and guess what, he overthrows it. So it's, like I said, when it's when it's tough to throw across the middle and throw it deep, that's what I mean. It's one, you're like, it's hard to get the free form down. Two, sometimes you'll just drop it. Or three, you'll just get sacked before you can even throw it. So that's definitely unfortunate break for him. Right here, he's going to go to verticals, and he fumbles. Go get the ball, coach. Go get me the ball. How he Mahomes got the ball. What? <laughs> How did Mahomes get the ball out of all people right there, guys? I mean, I saw the ball. I'm like, all right, bro. This is my – I got to go get the ball. You see me with my user, number 21. I'm coming down for the ball. Somehow, Mahomes gets the ball. I don't know how, but it's all good. Um all we gotta do is get a get one stop right here. It's fourth in a million. And all we have to do is stop them one time. Um, we're gonna send the dogs. That's what we do. I don't know if this defense is the best. Hopefully my you know, hopefully my 25, hopefully sauce goes crazy over there. And alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna change them to third because I don't like that. I have a contain on the right. I'm not gonna accept this. If he wants to go for it, he can. I mean, I'm not gonna accept it personally. There's no point. And we're gonna switch it up. Instead of running man, we're gonna run a little bit of this. Oh my gosh, I didn't get set up. He's gonna have a dot, 100%. Swat it down, great swat. Swats are fantastic in this year's Madden, guys. Utilize them to the best of your ability. They will get you stops like that when you need them. One thing they did right, one thing I really love is the swats in this year's game, man. Trust me, 100%. The swats are fantastic. Um, they're maybe honestly a little too OP. I've seen times where, you know, they've, they've warped to the ball almost, but you know, one thing for sure, I love swats 16 to 30, not the best stat line for a rod, right? We're not used to seeing this type of stat line, but the thing is, you know, we're, 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 we're finding a way we're finding a way to win. That's all that matters in this year's Madden. That's all that matters in any Madden. What, what, however you win, if you win, you win right here, just trying to get this first and not fumble. 30 inches, I'll take it. 
I could have thrown that running back. I definitely should have tried to fit that ball in. Like I said, I have Aaron Rodgers, the best QB in terms of, you know, f- passing and fitting uh, fitting passes through the needle or whatever. Um, definitely got to take advantage right here. We're going to try it. And that's what I mean with the free form. Sometimes you just overextend it. Definitely did right there. I didn't want to get picked, though. I mean, it's obvious. Like, I had to, I had to step on him, but it's all good. We move on. Try to try to convert right here. I don't know about these plays. I'm not. I'm really just trying to look. Just pass to Lazard, right here. Do we have it? We have it this time, thankfully. He was playing aggressive defense. I had a feeling like that might have been open again, and you know that's really what I was looking for. So definitely got to get in the lab and master my reads. Um, but you know, so far doing a pretty good job. Even though you know, McCall Hardman is low key bailing me out, and so is A Rod. Mainly our defense has been playing good. That's all I care about. All right, guys. I'm going to switch it up. I'm going to run a little bit of nickel normal just to show you guys what types of defenses are good in this year's game and, you know, everything you could do. You could do a lot in this year's Madden. I'm going to run nickel normal right here. We, I think I did turn on match. And I'm going to get a Justy with it. Uh, just just for your warning, I'm about to get a Justy with it. So just 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 watch the, watch the show. Right here, I couldn't get my adjustment set up. But we still play really good defense. I know you guys saw that zone. That was a match three wreck. I had no flat over there, and it went crazy for me. So, hey, shout out to that zone for, for honestly helping me out right there. Right here, we're going to get crazy. We're going to get a Jesse real quick. Um, okay, I was not ready for flood. Flooded, and we get lucky. Hey, we get lucky regardless. Flood is in a, in a tier of its own, man. You got to really lock in for that quick hiking flood. Super effective, man, no matter what Madden it is. So we get we get another fortunate break right there. And I'm trying to set up this uh this nickel normal. And I just can't right now, but it's all good. Cause we're still gonna try things out. That's what the beta is for. This is what these gameplays are for to show you and try things out. We're sending a bleacher blitz off the left edge. I don't know where my match zones were. Maybe match is in it. Maybe match is in it, but Kelsey is wide open right there. Um, next time I'll man him up hundred percent. Right here, just can't get my plays off. We got really good defense. I don't know where my three wreck went that time, but good defense nonetheless. So I'm, I was expecting tight, but he's now in bunch. Might have to go back to, uh, there we go. We're in tight now. And let's see if we could uh, set up our play in time. We do. Trying to scream, and there we go. That's what I wanted right there. Even though he's, he sent out what, like five routes probably on that play? We get the pressure we were looking for. We were we were looking for that pressure, man. We were, we were we were finally looking for that pressure, and we finally got it. Right here, back him up. I know flood is going to be open. This is a matter of fact. Is my pressure going to come in in time, or is he is he going to make the read in time? If he runs flood, it will 100% be open. And Amos, he drops another pass. I mean, he's he's getting he's getting pretty unlucky right now. I cannot lie to you guys. I don't know who that is over there, but he is selling them out hard. And we're going to send the same blitz again. We're just trying to adjust, and we sent one too many people this time. But they all came home. I think he back protected too. Simple was like, bro, who am I playing? What did, why is he running these weird-ass blitzes? I did not mean to send that many. I did, I did try to send the two extra corners. I did not want to send the li extra linebacker as well. But, hey, man, whatever gets the job done, we cannot complain. Uh, right here, I'm going to try to look for Garrett Wilson. And... Ooh, I end up dropping it. I might have had an open read down the middle. I think the streak might have been open, guys. Don't don't, don't bash me in the comments if I had the streak open. Because I was looking for something else. But yeah, I think I might have had something open. Right here. Throw it to... Bruh. You guys see, see my what I'm talking about. It's just random things like that that could definitely tick you off, and that could I it, could, it happens in this game. I don't know why. Um, right here, we're gonna run flood. Remember, we ran flood earlier, and we couldn't get the pass off. Right here, we get screamed at. We'll take the throwaway any day of the week, right there. All right, we're still in thin water. We gotta we gotta get a completion right here. Otherwise, he could definitely come back. Um, what is the play call right here, guys? I think we're gonna no. This play did not work last time. It did not work last time. Um, this is probably a better play. All right, this is this will do. And that's a literal guess read of hell. <laughs> that's a literal guess read of hell. As soon as I've seen him take one step to the running back, 
I'm like, all right, we got to throw it. But nonetheless, that's honestly a pretty good route combo. Just not one for fourth down and long. Um, I'm literally freestyling right now, guys. Just trying to show you guys, you know, some of some of, some of the stuff that be going through my head. Um, right here, pass it, and we. I don't know how I caught that. I should have thrown it a second earlier. I'm just afraid these users are gonna jump out the roof. In reality, you, they don't be they don't be moving like that. But I don't know. That was open, but I just threw it a second too late. Right here, guys, bench for the bread. This was my go-to play last year, and we're gonna throw it again. And I dropped a high ball. I didn't even realize I highballed it. That just can't be a thing, man. It's open. You can't drop high balls. You just can't do it. Um, so if you guys like or have a bad highball habit, you might want to check in and work at, at Whataburger this year, bro. Because I don't know, bro. We got we got some we got some open reads being dropped right here. Trying to take off with a rod. Throw it away. I had I had a circle. But I just I, no way am I throwing that. I'm just sitting here just reminiscing on the times I used to be able to highball, man. It's great times. It was really good times right here. I don't know how he was out of bounds, but we'll take it. That's a great dot. That's a great setup. I kind of quick hiked him, but he was scrambling a little bit too much. And we'll take it, man. It wasn't it wasn't fluid. I feel like I got on like five million fourth and third downs this game. But you guys see the potential with the Jets offensive playbook and the Jets team in general. This team is amazing in regs. You have a good enough offense to where your defense will get you stops. 100% guarantee your defense will get you stops. Um, whether you run man, whether you run zone. I, I personally don't really run zone too much yet. There have been a few plays like a cover two Mabel or like a cover three with a man hybrid. Stuff like that. But yeah, I feel like um, let's run cover three cloud right here. But I feel like defense with the Jets makes life so much easier. Right here. Just cover three cloud. Go user the corner out. I got a PI right there. He's going to go deep. I thought he was going to go deep. Nonetheless, free play. So once again, GG's is civil. Hopefully you guys got some insight and some knowledge into, you know, regs, into some of these playbooks, into some of the metas. I know it was a sloppy gameplay, but that's how it's going to be sometimes, man. Especially this year, a new game. It's going to be sloppy for sure. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Till next time, take it easy and comment and like what you want to see next. And I'll definitely make some content on that.